Chabrier knocks it to the half wall. Ool knocks it left corner. And the Black Bears control the puck. Back up on top here. Chabrier with a drive. Score! Chabrier just 37 seconds in. May have been a screen in front, Mike, but Maine breaks through. That's the first first period goal Merrimack has allowed. Chabrier scores the goal there. You're going to see right here. There is some traffic in front, and it sneaks by Bogiel. I think glove side, actually. Yeah, it looked like a couple guys screening perhaps in front, and also I think okay, you see Bogiel trying to peer around the players in front of him. I think that's what. Uh, Merrimack usually scores the first goal in a game, but not tonight. Or last night. Yeah, the Warriors, he had Forsmark on the left wing. They're to take the shot. Here's Capone right to the goal. Backhander just wide with some shifty stick moves there. And he'll take a heavy bump. Now Harrison Scott, the former Bentley Falcon, at the near circle. Here's a quick shot saved by Bourdiel. That was Harrison Scott. I can work it out to center. Here's Capone into the main zone. Capone, far circle, gets around his man to the goal. Shot. What a save by Osman. Like Capone is fearless going to that net. Yeah, I mean, now between last night and tonight, we've seen him do that a few times. Unfortunately, though, for him, it hasn't resulted in anything. And the loose puck here. Shot saved by Osman. And a Briar, a heavy hit in the main zone. Here come the Black Bears. Poisson trying to go wide on Jurasevic. Shot saved. Loose puck in the slot. They chop at it. Here's a shot on for Gil by Poisson. Bring it out to center ice. Black Bears carry in. Shot from the far circle. Poor Gil goes down to block it. Bears will work it to the Merrimack line. Frank Jurasevic trying to play it away from Lyndon Breen. Now Nadeau to Breen back to Nado. Shot score! Bradley Nado on the setup from Breen. And Maine in good position. And they finish the playoff. 8 18 will be the time. 2 0. Been outstanding this weekend. Breen looked like he was looking maybe to go deep in the zone, and then he turns back and gives it to win on the road. But on Saturday, they weren't able to come back. Here's to know in front. Shot just wide. Crowd very quiet at the moment here at Lawler Rink. Backhand dump. Black Bears look to center one. Push on the doorstep. Shot saved by Borgiel. Boards. And a quick pass for the defenseman there taking the shot. But quickly it comes back up on top. Jeffrey, he'll hold and look in the slot area. Quick shot. Oh, that was a chance for Matthew Capone. Here's Felton. The puck to his left. There's a pass that's fanned on. Black Bears will bring it back into the offensive zone. Quick shot for Gil to save, and he lost the goaltender stick to boot. And then Chabrier. Merrimack keeps in at the point. Quick shot save. Osman a second save there. Again behind the goal. Black Bears trying to be opportunistic with Borgiel temporarily out of the net for a moment. Steal in front shot save. Borgiel a turnover and a direct chance. Their territory. Here's Breyer down low. Sends it cross ice. And a shot over the top of the back over to Bookman. Over the line to know. He's got one man to beat. To know trying to move in. And he gets the shot away. As he was taken down. Lead to a pair as Maine brings the puck in the offensive zone here. Good stick work by Mac Welsher on the defensive end. Bookman trying to lay the puck in front. Here's a loose puck in front. Shot for Giel got a piece of that. Black Bears working in the slot shot. Score. Nado again. He'll pick up his second. Puck, and then he backed off a bit. But what happened was nobody picked. Here he is backing off. And it, it, actually, he would, went right there. So the puck goes in the corner. Breen's got it. He's looking. He finds Nadeau. He's right there. There's three, four wards. Merrimack's penalty kill is tied for sixth in the country. Maine's power play tied for 46. Lead pass shot. Save Jeffries as he broke in alone with a shorthanded bid. For the puck in deep, Breen. Chips it toward the front of the goal. And from the far circle shot, save Borgiel. Rebound, another save. Borgiel caught out of the net as the puck rolls into him. And Borgiel trying to tie it up. Apparently, he had it tied up long enough. Dennison swings one to Felton. His shot through traffic. Save made. Loose puck down low. Centering pass. Skated out of harm's way. Welsher and Young attack into the main end. Black Bears will play it from behind their net. Welsher trying to. Grab a loose puck. He scores on the turnaround. Back Welsher on a play that developed very quickly. And on the little stuff attempt, Welsher scores at 541. Merrimack is on the board. It's 3 to 1. The net and stuff that you see here, uh, the Young actually is able to be the guy who starts that off. And then Welsher picks. Hey, Harry, now Maine gets someone back in the play. 
from the far circle. Quick shot. Osman the save. Loose puck, and he will cover for the faceoff. Playing on two different lines, but put out there together that time. Welsher over the line, looking for a two-on-one. He slid the puck, but it wound up going back to the corner. Maine again getting back defensively. Providence, Friars, the Wildcats played a tie last night. And uh, this Merrimack will be in stores on Friday to take on UConn, and the Huskies will return the trip Saturday. And that's our next home broadcast here on ESPN+. Plus. Loose puck in front, shot, score from the near circle. Are not. Got a poke at. And that's a big goal for Maine to reestablish that three goal lead. You see, work in the corner by Arnott. Poisson's right there, and he lets that one go. Of course, Jeffrey's just made his first appearance last night. And here's a save by Borgil as he slid across. The Chabrier battling Brower for it up on top. Here's a quick shot blocked by Dennison. This puck is going to roll wide. Bradley Nadeau behind the net looks for uh, a teammate in front. Shot score. And that one is buried by. Shuley, Sully Shuley will pick up his first collegiate point. By the Breen line, the Nadeau brothers in particular, you see Brad Nadeau, the pass out to Shuley, who just come on the ice, and Shuley. Warriors bring it out to center. Here's Bookman into the main zone. Bookman, centering pass. They roll it just wide. Sotero was there. Brazil sends it ahead. Over the line for Renwick. Renwick lays it in the slot. The puck dribbles wide. Of Mays just won an awful lot of little battles from start to finish in this game. Over to Felton. Charging the net. Felton in front. And they tried to finish it off. A bang, bang play. And Rice Black Bears with an odd man rush into the offensive zone. Shot hit the post. As Maine brings the puck in the offensive zone, they get it in front. Free over the drive. Olas kicks it up. Rebound shot blocked in front. Looking for Capone. Capone in the corner, comes off the wall. Capone centering it out in front, shot, score! Jeffries! There's his first goal of the year on a beautiful setup by Matt Capone at 348. They're certainly going to need goals and points from him. And it he'll bring it into the Merrimack zone. Friel holding in the high slot, shot, save Olas with the glove. And the Black Bears will send it around the boards. Lead pass and a breakaway here. And off to the races is Lyndon Breen, and he shoots it wide. So the top line for Maine against the top line for Merrimack. We've seen Maine have the better edge at one point. Here's Breen down low, and he had an opportunity. Puck top over his stick. Olas with a great club save. Decided to draw that up as something to try. Satera trying to get around his man. It's backhand to score! From the edge of the far circle, Michael Satera has cut the lead down to two, so don't go away. We've seen him score some nice goals. You see Dennison with the feed up there. He gets just enough room around Brazil to be able to. Now Bookman looking for Welsher broken up. Here come the Black Bears into the offensive zone and a pass across by Josh Nadeau is broken up. Welsher trying to center one. They get it low for Satera. Nice pivot. Centering pass. Welsher was there and he shot it wide. Black Bears will send it up to Wal Capone. Gets it in front. And they had a man there, shot just wide. Hillier into the Black Bears zone. He'll hold it. In front, they got a man there. Sotero with the backhander saved by Osman. I don't think before this year, Scott Bork would have pulled the goaltender this early down by two. We'll see what happens here. All right, back to the point. Bookman. Score! Bookman sends it to the far circle and Pryor. I'm sorry, Jeffries. Jeffries picks up the goal. That's his second. And all of a sudden, it's a one-goal game with 3.44 to play. So right off the draw, you see Capone wins it. They get it back to Bookman. Right to Jeffries at the left dot where he likes to work. Jurasevic up ahead to Capone. Saucer pass, far circle, shot right on. Osman the save, and he'll cover it up. Keeps the puck alive, turns the puck over. Black Bears knock it out to center, but Merrimack has bodies there. Forsmark lost the handle on it. Black Bears head toward the empty net. They'll work it down low. They've got a man in front, and the wraparound does not work. Arnott up top. His shot blocked as they had Capone in the crease acting as the goaltender. Hmm. We're down to 12 seconds to go. They have to hurry. Felton across the red line into the main zone. To his left, Jeffries fires one. Osman, the glove save. He wants to play that puck. He'll play it to the corner smartly. Merrimack will center one, and time will expire. Maine gets the weekend sweep with a pair of one-goal wins here in North Andover.